Hi. Welcome back. We're doing something different today. Who knows that on another planet, aliens would have eyes, nose, and mouth on a face, half animal, half plant. Like, we don't know. There's so many possibilities, and I racked my brain trying to think of all the different things that an alien could look like. And so, to try and help me from going crazy, <laughs> Colin has made an app that you can add traits to, and it will randomly generate those traits and give you combinations that you may never have thought of. I've also been using it for things that Cullen did not intend it for, <laughs> yeah. such as random meals, like food combinations, and... Cuss words, right? Cuss words, <laughs> yeah. Just a bunch of cacophonous letters and see how they can be slapped together and there's a cuss word. Also, randomizing side characters, their traits and stuff, and yeah, it's just been a really cool app and we will be, well, He'll be putting it on the App Store. We will be putting the link below, so be looking for that. <laughs> and it will also be free and without ads, yes. because why not? I think that's it, so why don't we get drawn? All right, as you can see, we've got sheets of paper to draw our creations yes. on. And we've got our phone for randomizing our species. Would you like to do the honors? All right. I missed it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, okay. It's got just a bunch of teeth as a defense. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I want to bring out our little exoskeleton friend. <laughs> Good morning! Boop! <laughs> Good job! Still All right. snoozing on the job. Mm -hmm. Timer is ready. And go. <laughs> Actually going for a block right now. <laughs> oh, shh. I forgot about the block. <laughs> Blocky muzzle. So I'll, I'll smooth it out a bit. How do you draw that? I, I don't know. I've just made it a, a trapezoid. <laughs> I feel like this is not doing our actual drawing skills justice. Oh, no, it is not. It's not going terrible. Mm -hmm. That good. That good. That good. Let's give him little eyebrow horns. Oh, but it needs rows of teeth, too. Don't forget the defense. Teeth, teeth, teeth. Teeth, teeth, teeth. Oh, time is up. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm sorry, Roman. <laughs> I just spun him a little. So this is a, a Rick Snorty. Mm. A Rick Snorty. It's kind of like this guy, except it's more like an ant. So it's got like a, a thorax and an abdomen, like a three-part body. The head has that blocky nose, mm -hmm. and then when it opens its mouth, it's just like a shark. It's just teeth. And on top, it has these three segmented vines that it uses to grapple its prey. And then it's also got a floppy tail because evolution just said, why not? <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> so that, that's a Rick Snorty. <laughs> okay. Mine is... The Rick Ractor. The Rick Snorty and the Rick Ractor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's vines kind of bring in scent, like this little guy's antenna. Okay. So he doesn't have eyes or, let's say she. She doesn't have eyes or any sense of smell over here, but all her vines pick up scents. <laughs> so it's got to like slap things to smell them. Yeah. <laughs> um, there's a floppy tail, which um, let's say this is an underwater creature. So 
Uh, she uses that to swim. She's got this exoskeleton and um, <laughs> rows of teeth. I mean, obviously, she's really aggressive. <laughs> You're doing okay, buddy. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to fall off that cliff. I want to fall off this cliff. <laughs> Here you go. Yeah, buddy, go. I also drew this one. <laughs> it's moving? <laughs> Animation. <laughs> Honey, don't fall. <laughs> He's fine. I can put him back. I believe I can fly. Thank you. All right, and Ooh. paralyzing defense. It'll paralyze you. Dang. Or it's like a fainting goat and it paralyzes itself for uh. whatever reason. <laughs> the time starts now. Okay, triangular face. What are these like tree branches? They're whatever kind of branch you want them to be. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Me too. <laughs> Smudging with my finger, even though my art teacher told me not to. <laughs> <laughs> that's time. Ah, okay, that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> this is my bumpatu. Bumpatu. It is very much like a tree, but it's soft and bumpy, and. It has those thin branches that are kind of like a willow. Uh -huh. uh, it gets its energy from the sun like a tree and produces these little circular fruits or whatever. Uh, but unlike a tree, it can walk around on these bony legs. <laughs> Was that it? What uh, defense did it have? Paralyzing defense. Oh, okay. Well, if you eat its fruit, then it paralyzes you. We'll just draw a little unfortunate guy who ate a fruit, and now he's paralyzed. <laughs> you did. <laughs> so this is a a woolly mollusk. <laughs> I like him. I think it's funny that we both like took inspiration from trees because I took like it has like fern fronds and mm -hmm. stuff for like its legs and arms. These things they live in the forest and they're very rough and they kind of wander around and they don't really like anything. <laughs> As you can see, this, this bird here got in its way and it just kind of slapped and it paralyzed it. And so now the bird's asleep or dead. Wow. It's got quite bony legs that it stands mm -hmm. on and runs around. And mm -hmm. yeah, it's pretty yeah. hunchback. It runs. <laughs> <laughs> so that was quite challenging to draw completely randomized creatures. In five minutes. Yeah, again, I'm gonna make the app available for free on the Android app store. Like, I don't have a Mac, so I can't make it for iOS. So sorry, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and be sure to tune in next week for something else. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you. See you next time. Bye.